Right, A-level physicists, let's see how we get on with this question. We've got a mechanics and moments based question here, and the scary thing is there's very little numbers. So we're trying to figure out this angle here. The information we have is the weight of this uniform bar, um, and we also have a weight attached at the end here. So the tension in this rope, which acts in that direction, is 4W. The one thing they haven't labelled on is where the centre of mass of the bar acts, and that's from the same point here with uh, the weight is W, and that goes half the way along the bar. Now, if we treat this end as a pivot, uh, we can then make it a moments problem, um, because we've got moments going clockwise and anti-clockwise. So let's set this up first of all. The easy bit to do is the clockwise moments, so that way we've got W acting downwards, and we've also got um, W that's twice as far away. So I'm going to call that basically two times W just because when we've got a moment, we've got force times distance. So if it's twice as far away, we have to then add an extra term of two in there. Going the opposite direction, we've only got this force acting upwards. However, we only need to consider its perpendicular component in this direction. It has to be the same as the line of action that's what perpendicular to the surface. So we therefore have to resolve it. So let's draw a little triangle out and we've got 4W this way. Uh, that's going to be a hard pot and use. We're trying to work out this angle here. Um, and because of similar angles, we know this angle is going to be the same as that angle. So I'm going to say that we know this angle here. So we're trying to work out in this direction. Uh, we hopefully should see that this is going to be equal to 4W cos uh, theta because it's the adjacent. So therefore, we've got 4W times by cos theta. Now, even though this looks a bit messy still, we can simplify it. 2W plus W makes 3W. Um, and then to find cos theta, I'm just going to get the 4W on this side. Obviously, the Ws cancel, so I've got uh, theta is going to be equal to uh, inverse cos of uh, 3 over 4, and that happens to equal about 41.4-ish uh, degrees, which is going to be option A for this question.